got the Gamma Phi Gamma. Hey, if you're from New York, you're gonna love this one. Oh, Shelton. Yeah, really, my boy? Shelton. Guess this room gives Spike Lee's history. video it's your boy rail here and as you can see by the title guys we actually came all the way from the bronx to brooklyn we want to show you guys the spike lee exhibit here right in the brooklyn museum hopefully you enjoyed this video hopefully you enjoyed it love you guys stay tuned don't forget to like and subscribe so let's go all right guys the first room black history and culture wow it's amazing in here look at this everybody This is amazing. Is it safe to say Spike Lee had mentioned that a lot of these art the exhibits were sitting in his office? Yeah, I know how big is your office, bro. Yeah, how many pieces did you have in one <laughs> office? He has like another 200 pieces to put in another exhibit. Hey, maybe, right? Maybe, because I mean, it's a lot of stuff in here. We, this, this is the first room, guys. So we're going to get right into this. So they got the Malcolm X exhibit over here. This is really nice. Wow. Look, there's also a picture here of Malcolm X. Wow. It's amazing, right? It's beautiful. Wow. It's a very powerful piece. Like, just looking at it. It's like this one also, man. Like that. Wow. So you know, Spike Lee used to challenge a lot of, uh, you know, black cultures and stereotypes yeah. in the black community. Guys, look, Spike Lee outfit. This is amazing. Wow. I just want to touch it. I don't even want to let me touch it. That's cool. The outfit is lit. See the outfit there? You're with it? Yeah, pretty different. <laughs> I, ain't lie. I thought it was um, Dapper Dan, but it's saying it's virtual album. Hey, the glasses, everything. It's amazing. <laughs> Not my drip, but hey, it's like he has some drip, chill, stop guys, so he, he got a collection of books. Oh, some great books, too. Wow. So is it safe to say Spike like to read a lot of books? Yeah. Read a lot of books? Yeah. If y'all know any of these books, guys, kind of down below. Yeah. Wow, that quote was amazing. So it's dope to know like Spike Lee used to look out the window and certain things that are known in his early films. That was definitely like something that you'll see every day in a community, a black community, low poverty community, which was actually something you could relate to. Yeah, of course, especially if you come from where we come from, very relatable. I think one of his most powerful movies was Malcolm X. I think that was one of my favorites. So room number two, which is family. Wow, guys. Oh, they got one of his classic movies playing. Okay. Okay. Oh, look, look just like they did. Wow. <laughs> That's why she looked like her mom and he looked like his dad. <laughs> That's pretty cool. This room is beautiful. Wow. Guess this room gives Spike Lee's history. As I look at Spike Lee's wife, I start to remember. I used to see her every morning when we when I used to work on 63rd Lexus. Mm -hmm. And I do remember his daughter actually coming out every day. Oh. She had a personal driver every morning right. to come pick her up. So this is where you get that lead from, huh? Mm. 
Yeah, we was wondering where uh, uh, Spike Lee got his name from. From the grandmother. <laughs> yeah, he changed his name. That's what I told him. <laughs> Shout out to Mama Love. Hey, it's amazing, guys. So shout out to Morehouse guys. Can't come in here and not shout out uh, Spike Lee's college. He's a young scholar of Morehouse. So that's pretty dope, man. So he was influenced by his family, his friends, his community, his early neighborhood growing up. It's amazing to know he put a lot of his family and friends in movies early on. So if Spike Lee get to see this video, I'm looking for a role, man. I could be a stand-in or stun guy. Right now. Yeah. We're gonna be in a Spike Lee film. The next Spike Lee film. Bruh. Yo guys, comment down below, what's one of your favorite Spike Lee fans, man? I think I'm running with Maka Max at this point. And I like Crooklyn. Crooklyn was pretty dope also. But this is like the third room, Brooklyn. Wow. Check this one out, right? Sal's Pizza. I ain't got a lot of one of these guys. Yes. One of these yes. Sal's Pizza. Wow. Wow. Maybe not a Sal's Pizza. That's fine. So this one of my favorite movies, Do the Right Thing. Mm. Remember this from the movie? When they used to, uh, where they, the scene where they was in a uh, radio station, what was the same thing was happening? Yeah. He's like, come on, man, what y'all doing out here? Wake up, wake up! That's pretty dope, man. Red Star, do a dog. Here we got the famous Saul Pizza. Saul himself. <laughs> Is it safe to say Spike Lee was definitely not a basketball player? He just was a fan of the sport. So, wow. Spike Lee was really short. Oh, look at this photo of young Spike Lee. Wow. Absolute Brooklyn vibe. This is nice, too. Wow. Yo, guys, you ever walk the Brooklyn Bridge? Comment down below. Yeah, I ain't never walked the Brooklyn Bridge, guys. That's bad, right? Look at all of this art. This is wonderful. Wow, this picture is amazing. Wow. Even this picture. This is so nice. Didn't we have everyone in the photo? Wow. Look at that. Awesome. I'm loving this. Wow, fight the power. Hey. That's pretty good, right? Hey. Hey. So he was obsessed with Michael Jordan. Is how is that possible? You obsessed with Michael Jordan, but you a Knicks fan to the heart? Hey, listen, I don't know about the Knicks too much. Yeah, I don't know. The Knicks in the struggle, <laughs> Spike Brown, every single time, every single game, huh? Hey, uh, I give it to him because he's a John Hawkins. Wow, it's like the Spike I remember, like from back in the day, yeah. Reverend wow. Run, yeah. Run DMC. Spike Lee, uh, Nike, uh, Jordan game was impeccable back in the day. Right? <laughs> to the point they just gave him his own, uh, his own sneaker. Spike style, Spike style, Spike style. So check these jackets out. Remember this movie, School Days? Oh, this jacket on fire. Yeah, babe, what you do for one of these School Days jackets? Dang, don't let them see me. I'm about to see I got the Gamma 5 Gamma, hey. <laughs> I like this one. And it just looks so old school. Got that tough feel to it. It's tight. It's like Teflon. You think so? He did. Like, look at the jacket. So like you were saying, all of these pieces were just sitting in his office. So my question was, how many pieces did he have sitting in his office? I don't know, but how big is your office? I'm keep asking you. Like, yeah, so it seems to assume that you probably got so many more pieces that didn't even make it. So if you got pieces that didn't make it to the museum, just pass them to us, man. Samuel Jackson made it to the museum. Yeah, and that's one crazy dude, even Lauren Frisberg. Y'all know Lauren Frisberg, the young Lauren Frisberg. From the movie Higher Learning. Yeah. That's pretty dope. Man. Higher Learning was a classic too. Crop Kirkland, Higher Learning, Do the Right Thing. Comment down below, what's your favorite movie, bro? So, are y'all ready to be wild? You're from New York, you're gonna love this one. I don't know if I'm gonna love this one. Hey, well, if you're across the bridge in New Jersey, you might not like this one. But let's see what they got to hold. Well, this is the next one. This is the Sports Memorabilia and Spike Lee represent his favorite team, which is the New York League. Oh, no, Spike Lee. Look at the jersey. You know what that is? You know any of these people? 
John Stock. Patrick Ewing. Yeah, I don't have to do it. Charles Oakley. Bernard King. I know you know. These are some of Spike's favorite Knicks. I, I noticed all of these Knicks are bullies. Like all of these Knicks was like the heart of the team. These were the Knicks that definitely would elbow you for the team. They'd take one for the team. Yeah, it's on on the court. Yo, straight from New York. You already know. See, I think Spike was really obsessed with the old school Knicks, like from back in the days, the 1970s and stuff like that. I don't care what nobody say. Patrick Ewing was one of the worst Knicks we ever had. <laughs> fact, that's a fact. No rings. So you uh, Trash bag. Whatever. I can say the same thing about Marshmallow. Uh, Glide. Hey, that's my piece too. I was telling you back then, you know, with the shorts. The shorts above the knee. Yeah, the short, short. That's so you can dribble the ball. You might want to go up and do a between the legs dunk or something. You never know, man. Look, guys, it's an original Nick Nick. Is it? So clean, though. You definitely, like, when the ball go in the net, you hear the tearing up that net. This captain returns to Spike. Wow. Willis Reed. Wow. wow. It is. Oh, my God, look, that's some Nick tickets from back in the day. Wow. Yo, this is so cool. Guys, do you know anybody right here? I see the first person I know. Kobe. This guy, I don't know. I always think he's a strong actor. Oh yeah, he is a great actor. He's and a too, great actor. Yes, him too. And him. Hey, y'all know these people are? Let me know. He be on, he be on, what's that? It was Tubi movie. <laughs> Tubi, yeah, Tubi, Tubi. Yeah, like, this great. Is my yes, this is one of my favorite movies, so Black Panther. Cool. Denzel Washington's son. <laughs> yep. Who's oh, your man right here? Your man Michael? Hey. The next Look killer. <laughs> the next killer. They should just put him on the team and put him on the court. Stop playing. The mascot, he's definitely the mascot for the next. <laughs> no, no. Wow, this is an amazing portrait, guys. Yeah, look at this. Wow. Oh, yo, he always used to play like the crazy guys in the movies. <laughs> yo, that's crazy. Wow. Wow, guys, there's some amazing people in here. This is amazing. Wow. Oh, what's up, D? How you doing? Charlie, Charlie Murphy. That's a beautiful piece, guys. This is beautiful. So this way he had in his office. This is what he could have Yeah, wow. This is awesome, guys. <laughs> what? Yo, check this out, right? This is a fact. Shout out to All Hollows High School. This is when he was in All Hollows High School. He definitely was a, a member of the All Hollows freshman basketball team. He looks like a that. basketball player. This is that picture, because they got it in the lobby of the school. Wow. Bro. That's crazy. Hey, Muhammad Ali. Wow. Got the beach cruiser, the 69 beach cruiser. Yo, this is a nice car. Stop me. <laughs> they don't make them like that. Hey, Muhammad Ali has a nice taste. This, oh. Shelton, yeah, really, my boy? Shelton. Yo, the hair is on fleek, bro. In the outfit and the watch. Oh, oh wow, he was he's killing it. Picture of Bastia. Oh, the wow. young Bastia. Awesome. Wow. Yo, that's crazy. You know crazy. this guy is. Wow, he Stevie just... Wonder. Stevie wow. Wonder before the the, the dreads in the back. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> young Stevie Wonder. Hey, boy. When he could see better. <laughs> Wow, look at Frankie. So young. young. Dang. And yours chill. I still rock a jean jacket, okay? Not like, like this, though. This is the original. This, this classic. classic. <laughs> you touch this, it's gonna crack up. Oh, no, no. <laughs> yeah, this is wild, crazy. Wow, man, this is awesome. Yo, that's what's up. Hey. Probably, probably true. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> I 
made it to cinema history. Like he was a great filmmaker, a great producer, a great screenwriter. So yeah, it's about to go down. Hey, if I'm one of your outfits, my boy, and this right here is... You look like a young Willie Wonka. <laughs> what? Wow. Just like I gotta respect you, yo, because only you. Only you, like, only you. <laughs> what? He's influenced by Dapper Dan and them young, um, uh, Virgo Aldor. Oh, me and Rob was just talking about this the other day. Y'all ever heard of The Five Blood? Nope. I know Six Crips. <laughs> Oh, look at these trophies. Stop. We cut heads. She got an award. The wow. cannon, cannon. She got a hat. She got a hat. We got an award. Wow. If God is willing and the creek don't ride, yes. P Boy Award for the lead group. Yes, man. Oh, look right here. Like Tommy Cheese. Oh, for the Black Pants, man. I tell you, this is one of the best movies of all time. Black Klansman was okay, but I really, I, I, mean, I, I, I can you compare that to what you gonna compare to Chirac? You no. think what movie was better, Chirac or the Black Klansman? The Black Klansman. <laughs> sorry, sorry. You got something for this one to a British Film Award. Oh, see? And a Lifetime see? Achievement Award also. See, I know what I'm talking about. This movie reminds me of that movie, remember Throw Mama from the Train? Yeah, yeah French Connection. <laughs> French Connection. Yo, babe, this wasn't a classic movie right here, though. The it's Miracle of Saint Anne. Yeah, that was a great And this was the, look, the statue that they used for good luck. Wow. Uh -huh. Wow, this is amazing. Wow. That one was a classic. It's really hard to pick which one was one of his best films, so. I think you could sit down and binge watch a lot of Spike films. This is probably one of the movies that always made me scared of the ocean or any type of beach, water. Any Spike Lee was in this film? Bruh. This movie. Spike Lee was in the first Joe? No. Oh, he played Joe. <laughs> but this, this movie was something else. This is why I'm scared of swimming. <laughs> It's funny how Jazz is afraid to swim, but she wrestled a gator when we went to the gator land. She wrestled the gator down, she tagged him up, and then we ate him after that. Yeah, we did, actually, we did. So she's scared of a shark. But I'm scared of a shark, you know, Wow. So maybe it's safe to say, like, when a lot of the film directors was making movies, they thought of Spike, maybe they, Spike inspired them inside their film. Is it? Yo, Spike, I need a job. Like, can I just get an obvious extra? I, man, I served the bagels and the orange juice in the beginning until I let you know I got it. So yeah, yeah, yeah. It like, yeah. Spike Lee was the original Black Panther. Oh, man. <laughs> wow. Oh, boys in the hood, baby. Boys in the hood. This is a classic movie. What's the first thing that comes to your mind for a process when you think of boys in the hood? Um, what scene? When they killed the brother. When they shot the brother. Ricky! As you know, Spike Lee wasn't afraid to attack and do controversial things. So this is some of like the blackface from like Bamboozle. From 2000. And then you know the dad, the drunk dad from the neighborhood, the mayor. <laughs> the mayor, mama, don't bother nobody. Yep. As a kid, I think my older brothers made me watch this movie, and I regretted it. Why? I never really understood Cornbread it. Cornbread Earl and me. Cornbread Earl and me. Uh, I think I even read the book too. Hey, we made it to music. We do the right thing, ladies and gentlemen. Amazing. We in the Galleria of Mustica. Yay. Wow. Wow, this is a nice picture. Hey. Wow. I think for everybody that's inspired by Spike, Spike is inspired by so many people, man. It's amazing, and I just want to say on my behalf, thank you for everything you've done for the culture, all the films that you've run, just the energy that you bring to New York City and the Garden. We love you, man, yes. and we appreciate you. He's a legend, guys. Remember, look at this picture. What? This is wild, wow, crazy. It's amazing. Is this like water paint? Wow, God. Wow, this is amazing, guys. Oh, yeah, big move. Y'all don't know Biggie Smalls. Where have y'all been? Oh, the one and only. Hey, looking real stylish. Yo, Biggie Smalls is one of my favorite rappers. <laughs> and then Biggie. Fabulous. And those, just to think, those are two Brooklyn rappers. Yeah. Yes, guys, this is amazing. Look, they got the Metro cards with the Biggie's on them. Hey. Oh, that's fine. Yo, 
you remember when they had those? Yo, two of my favorite fire. artists is from Brooklyn. Hey. And my favorite bronze artist right now is um, Ice Spice. He's definitely one of them. I like, I like that girl, what's her name? Maya the Don. Hey, I hey. like the big birdie when it go in function. Hey, hey, public enemy, baby. Oh, fight the power, guys. Public enemy, y'all already know it's flavor. Play. Yeah, That's playing boy. Right. Spike Lee with the baldy. Why are you looking like Ralph? Bruh. That's crazy. Yo, I was saying, why you never told me you was in school days? Me? You see yeah. me? Right here. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> Spike, we has so many different faces that you see, man. Oh, she gotta have it, baby. There you go, right there. Public hey. Enema. This was another film that threw me off. Yo, this is what I ain't gonna lie. This one, I had this on VHS. Oh, no better blue. Yeah, that one. Hey. The scene when he got beat up and they beat him up and took his uh, trumpet. <laughs> Makes media. Uh oh. -oh. The original box. Q tip. Box. Oh, they got the dice. Hey, okay. Remember the rapper Q tip? Yeah, of course. Yeah. They, wow. This is their like promotion box. I think Wu Tang actually did something like this, which is classic. You're not allowed to open it to like 2050. Oh, it's dang. A plastic custom album. Oh, it's my man Prince. Oh, uh, I love you, yeah, Prince. Prince. I believe play back. I love you, Prince. Oh, I don't know my about God. Rest in peace. Love Prince. Love Prince. His style, everything. This yeah. man was amazing. Yo, guys, you ever seen the movie The Warriors? Remember the guy? <laughs> what he look like? What <laughs> he look like? Stop it. Sure, do. <laughs> Wow, guys, I gotta love Prince. I love some Prince. Wow. Oh, your man Michael. Yo, why you look like you got a prison photo? It is. <laughs> and he probably created it and just sent it to Spike. Yo, that's wild crazy, Michael. Wow. Hey. Wow, guys, look, Jackson Bay, everybody in the picture. This it is like a kid wrote amazing. that. Wow. <laughs> By Michael Joseph. Oh, hey. The Jackson 8. Uh, yeah. They tell you they all in the photo. Wow, wow look at young amazing. Michael. Yo, can I have this wow. picture? Yeah, wow. Yo, this says a lot. It, like this says a lot. It went from how Michael used to look to how he looked before he died. Wow. Diana Rose, the young Diana Rose. Oh, Diana Rose. Diana Rose used to be wow. hot back in the day, man. I don't know. Beautiful. She Look at her. Got on her diva wow. She's then still Aretha beautiful. Franklin on hey, the Aretha. Hey, Aretha. Hey, girl. African band bottle. I love this photo. It's really nice. Wow. Hey, let's get it on. Every time I listen to his music, I think of my dad, man. Oh. My dad loved this old school type classic music. Wow, guys. This is freaking awesome in here. Wow, what is that? Spike Lee, what is that? Look like an instrument. Wow. Oh it is. Chill, look. It's like a like a like a like a like a trump, 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 a trump, a tumor, or tuba, or whatever. Wow, that joint is big. Oh, Charlie Parker, hey. You know who that baby? Yay. Wow. He's a jazz artist. Yeah. He played these instruments. <laughs> okay. Yo, that was official. Wow. I love me some jazz. <laughs> oh, it's my man Prince over there, Jazz. I play with him. True story, right? What's up? There was a guitar that Prince had, and Spike Lee wanted it, and Prince was not trying to give it to him. So he stole it. And then, you know, and then one day it just ended up in Spike Lee's office. Where's it at now? Say hello. Wow, he wanted that one so bad. He got it on Saturday night. Hey! I know Prince will be proud of you. Yeah. You get that thing and put it in your heart. Oh, I'm loving all of this stuff, guys. This is awesome. I love me some Prince, guys. Look, oh, yeah, I wasn't God. a real Purple Rain fan, man. I could never do Purple. Listen, oh, Prince man. was my man. Chill. Guys, look at this picture. My favorite team is in this picture, so I gotta love it. Let's go next. Absolutely not. Let's go Boston. <laughs> that play. Listen, Boston Celtics is my favorite team, guys. So this is my favorite picture in this whole museum right now. Interesting that they got the Jimmy Shuttlesworth one of my hands. Shuttlesworth. Hey. Wow, guys. Oh, it's Michael. Hey, Michael. Hey. <laughs> it's like, hey, look right here. Yeah, this is. Oh, 
awesome. Wow, guys. Yo, but you got a basketball card collection? Yeah, sure do. I think I got this one in the bridge. Oh, wow. Hey, Mike, how you doing? I was at Mike Tyson straight from <laughs> Best Style, yeah. <laughs> Get at you, Chip. <laughs> yep. Wow, that's awesome. That's nice. I want to touch it. Yeah, me too, but it's the lady there. <laughs> oh, get it, girl. Oh. Nope. Rosie Perez. Hey, girl, get it, girl. I got it. Tyson, Muhammad Ali, and I see George Foreman on the list. Wow, oh, look at this piece, all circles and a couple lines. Oh, that's nice. Hey, March 24th, 83. Mm. Well, could have drew that. My daughter could have drew that. <laughs> wow, Joe Lewis. And there go his shorts, too. Hey, the little short shorts. Joe Lewis. Wow. Big that jersey is, man. Wow, I know, right? Well, it's stretched out, I guess. Wow. Wow. I do you buddy. Magic Johnson when he was on Michigan State. Wow. Wow. Man to man, I think. Magic wow. Johnson when he was in college, NCAA. We beat the bird. You yep. know who the bird was? I know, they from Boston. Right? Yeah, Can't definitely was from Boston. Definitely know. was from Boston. Larry Bird. And when Michael Jordan jumped over the backboard. Oh my God, he was flying. Yeah, he was flying. <laughs> he jumped over the backboard. He did it in each Jordan three. That's why you see a lot of the young kids wearing those. They think they're going to be able to jump over the backboard. Y'all don't have that magic like Michael. That's the problem. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody wants to be like Mike. Okay. So. Everybody want to be like LeBron. Your kicks is fire, though. Your point. Jordan 7. Ooh, wee. Now look at these. The Jordan 11. Look at these. Wow. Pretty dope, man. Huh? You definitely cook these. I hate uh, these Jordans right here. Every time I bought them, as soon as you start choking them, it's over. Look at them. Once you choke these, it's over. They have to be a little better made, but yeah. And again, the Nick Ross. You see what I mean? These are definitely worn by Mike. See the difference between basketball sneakers and like people that wear sneakers? Mm -hmm. These is actually made to play basketball. Right. So we wear them for fashion, but they're comfortable for playing basketball. <laughs> wow, look at this guy's Pele, Pele. I know you know who this is. Hey, this is Beyonce half sister. Hey, that's what I'm Hey, look at that little tennis racket for Spike Lee. That's dope. That's fine. Yeah, see, the, the, the benefits of being a celebrity, people just give you stuff that you can just stash wow, and put it in the library or museum or something. This is the first ever black bat catcher. Ooh. He was catching the ball definitely with his hands. So that's amazing. Welcome to Brooklyn Dodgers. Wow. In 1947. Roberto Clemente. Hey, Roberto Clemente. Hey. Shout out to Roberto Clemente. Hey, shout out to Puerto Rico. Oh. We got that little gift shop here. We want to buy some merch, like a t-shirt. We also got like, I don't know, I guess, Spike type gear. Spike books. Spike class. $100 class. What? 
some books that I guess represent Spike Lee. That's a picture of Spike Lee gotta buy. <laughs> the Brooklyn Giant, 40 Acres and a Mule. Shout out to 40 Acres and a Mule. Yeah. Do the right thing, Platt. Jazz want this yeah, one looking like Sammy oh, Davis or something. So Dave, when you come, just try to pull up, get you some merch, make sure you got your money up, though. They want you a Puerto Rican San Bringo. <laughs> That's the one of those biker hats when you ride in a bike. <laughs> I like this thing, though, you know what I mean? Nice. Yeah. Definitely get you a nice little piece. Got the nice Mars chain. Yeah. Spike Lee Pat and that also. Pretty dope. I haven't seen one of these since I was a kid. Yeah, bro, I was just about to take it out of my head. For real? <laughs> so that's pretty dope, right? What do you think? I'm loving it. It was amazing. I have lots, lots, a lot. It's over 400 pieces, okay, in this. Um, I enjoyed it, man. I think a lot of the pieces I can relate to are definitely some of the films that I probably watched as a kid millions yep. of times. Yep. It's probably films I'm going to go home and watch Even right now. Even to this day, yes. So, man, we love you guys. That's pretty much it here for this museum. We're right here in the Brooklyn Museum. We love you guys. And don't forget to like and share and subscribe. To the channel. So we love, we love you guys. We out of here, man. We see you guys tomorrow. tomorrow.